Oh. Okay, that's probably the worst case scenario. That is exactly what we did not want. A UFO hunts the Avenger. If they keep imprisoning and torturing people, eventually someone's going to talk. Commander, remote re Hello everyone, Thranks is here, and welcome back to XCOM 2, War of the Chosen, episode 13, where we had a really, really tough mission, and uh, we got introduced to the uh, to the other Chosen, what do we got, supplies, no, not now, we got introduced to the other Chosen, uh, which it doesn't look like we're going to get to, yes, Jax Mon Tessura, the Grim Stalker, very, very tough, and challenging current action training hmm no soldiers captured or interrogated that's good we're gonna need to make contact with the Templars in order to have a chance against uh, or to have an advantage rather against that chosen now the question is where are we going to go we could go get more power we could get some more Intel Increase region income. We've got a lot of supplies right now. I'm tempted to say contacts. We still can make contact. Let's get the Avenger power. I think that's going to be in our best interest. If it's a permanent boost to our power, we want that. Let's get it. Okay, that's probably the worst case scenario. That is exactly what we did not want. A UFO hunts the Avenger. If they keep imprisoning and torturing people, eventually someone's going to talk. Commander, remote reconnaissance indicates the aliens have a UFO hunting for our position. We need to be careful about where we pick our flight paths. Right, so we're going to have to pay attention. I'm glad to see our joint effort paid off like we hoped. Yes! We're making good progress. Now we know for sure Jax Il Nailor has a facility here and we can start prepping a strike. Unfortunately, we still have to find a way in and seeing how the whole place is underground, I'm guessing things are only going to get more difficult from here on out. But our soldiers have returned. Commander, you'll be happy to hear our most recent covert action yielded some new intel on the Chosen. XCOM's influence with the Reapers has increased to high. That's what I'm talking about. you an honorary Reaper. Munitions experts and hunt the chosen assassin part three. Things are going so well. Sounds like my Reapers can take on some new orders. Ooh, experimental ammo projects and the proving grounds are completed instantly. That's awesome, but we're not ready for that yet. The factions have identified additional operations to benefit the resistance. We should meet in the resistance ring to examine it to examine their proposals. Our Let's take a peek. With the resistance factions has motivated them to share some new information on the chosen. Hmm. Templars. Hunt the Chosen Part 3. Unlock the Chosen Stronghold mission. Ooh, requires a major or higher. Not, not, not going to be able to do that. We can reduce the Avatar Project progress. Gather Intel collection. 33 Intel for 6 days. That doesn't seem all that great. I uh, kind of want to locate the Templars. Breakthrough research. Oh, yeah. Improves pistol damage by one. Uh, we'll, we'll do that eventually. I think we need to locate the Templars. Let's, let's make this happen. So, who do we have available? Who's ready to go? Um, it's going to require a sergeant for this one. Let's send, um, here, we'll send Rambunctious Ricky because uh, Roxanne's going to be taking it easy for now. And this will give a promotion. And then we just need one more soldier to go with you. And I'm thinking... We'll end up sending the tank. I want to keep the Drakian and Wild Rage and Heart Nine Kid Calibre on hand. So we'll send the tank... Soldier Wounded Moderate. Mm, we need to do it. Uh, so if one of you... As long as it's not Ricky getting wounded. No, let's let's do that. Alright, so we will begin the action. 
we'll get a new faction hero. Look at that. Okay, so that's eight days. Now, back to where we were, hiding from this UFO and trying to gain our power. What is this? Chosen stronghold. That's where it is. Okay. This will prove to have been an important breakthrough. Yes, research complete. The next excavation project to be completed instantly. Plated armor inspired. Our science team had a novel idea related to plated armor. If we begin this research immediately, we should obtain results faster than usual. So we have plated armor. 13 days, though. That's half the time. Magnetic weapons we could get in seven days. It's tough. We're going to have to go with the inspired research. 13 days? That means it's normally 26. And that'll give us all better armor, so... Let's do it. In word as soon as we have something of note. Let's do it. That's that's going to be a little bit. If we can get another scientist, that'll help out with that significantly. What's going on in here? Bond level two reached between Kid Calibre and Hart and I. Um, let's improve the bond in the training center. I think that's a good call, actually. For three days while they're training that's okay let's do that yep they're gonna get the spotter covert operators and stand by me I need to pay attention to that that covert operators thing that's good all right now back to what we were doing we're gonna get some things cleared out here pretty soon alien debris cleared Maximum power so unfortunately it, it just gave it to us on whichever one was already going that's that's disheartening. That did not work the way I wanted it to, but we've got two empty rooms now. I can't complain too much, and a lot of supplies. Once we get this power relay up, and... Oop, wrong button. And we get this power relay from here, we'll be able to start two new facilities. Power relay now operational. Nice. Avenger power capacity plus 10. Increases Avenger power. No. We're not going to put an engineer in here just yet. 10 power is good for now. Let's go ahead and start construction over here. What can we build? The proving ground is going to be important. The infirmary, the Psy lab, all things that are very, very important. Let's build the Psy lab. I want to get this going as soon as possible. And we're going to put an engineer in there, cut the construction time down to nine days. And let's go over here and let's build hmm, Proving Ground or the Infirmary. Let's do the Proving Ground. Proving ground facility yep, and we're going to put an engineer in there as well. There we go. Now we've got some stuff going on. All right. Do we have any new combat tactics we can learn? No, we do not. As soon as we can get a captain, as soon as we can get a captain, we can go ahead and increase our squad size by another one. All right, that's good. We'll keep getting power here. Two more days. Boom, Avenger power plus three. Passing low above the terrain, we spotted smoke rising from the remains of what was once a radio station and broadcast tower. Although the station itself is long since dormant, someone had rigged up a simple repeater using materials from the tower. Our engineering team was able to remove pieces of the generator and adapt them to boost the Avengers' power core. So these tend to... These look like uh, these little scanning things. They stick around longer than they used to. Mm, we could go for more contacts. Increase region income. We could put... Oh, we don't have the intel for that. Supplies, increase region. So we're going to get supply drop in two days. So the, the month is almost done, actually. Let's come back here to get some intel. For now. We don't have any. We need some. We spent it all on shortening the magnetic weapons research. Incoming message for you, Commander. Let's do it. it through to your quarters now. You have made considerable progress against the aliens over the past month, Commander. I hope that your ongoing efforts will only lead to further success. As do I. Monthly income, 282. Not bad. My focus 
All of my efforts have been rewarded. I am reinvigorated. Jet. I was good before, oh. but this is something else entirely. I'm on a whole other level. Mm, they've been training. Our intel is reporting that Chosen Hunter has increased in power. Adding an additional strength we will need to deal with in combat. Beastmaster can summon savage allies. Mmm, Jaxal Naylor can summon Advent Priests. A brutal crack crackdown on the resistance, permanently lowering XCOM's income. No, that's not good. Oh, that's not good. Okay, alright. Hidden event. Loyalty among thieves. When any chosen gains information about XCOM, a portion is passed along to the assassin as well. Mmm. Advent troopers carry more explosives. New alien facility construction imminent. Next retaliation strike in five weeks. We don't even have the intel to reveal what this hidden event is, but that's fine. I'm not. I'm a little worried about this. I'm not so worried about that. This one could be sort of a sleeper event, though, that it could be really bad, and I'm just not realizing it. But I'm not going to worry about it now. Yes. Okay. Hmm. So we can put in two more. Let's see. Resistance supply drops are collected instantly. That's pretty neat. Tech defense. We don't have the... Yeah, we have to raise the influence with the skirmishers to be able to use another one of those. But we can put in a couple of reapers, because I'm going to leave this modular construction one in. We need these facilities built, and the faster, the better. Uh, this would be neat, but... No, let's go with rapid collection. And I think we're going to go with Mm, covert actions will not be ambushed. Maybe we should do that. Yeah, let's do that. I don't think we absolutely need it right now, but we're going to do it anyways, just to be sure. All right. You're the boss. Supply drop. Now, we're going to go and get our supply drop. Do we not... So is the supply drop, like, picked up instantly? Is that? Build faster, gain intel. So it's almost like it just picked up all our supplies immediately. Right, we didn't even have to fly over and get them. That's kind of cool. Uh, that being said... Increase region income. More supplies. No, let's go ahead and let's 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 do this. What is this going to take? Fifty supplies. Yep, four to six days. Let's do that. Sector nine, Western That'll... United States. Right. All right. And people are recovering from their wounds. That's good. Kid Calibre and Hart and I got their bond to level oh, two. The, grounds are ready, Commander. the UFO is still zipping Jack, around. You give the word. All right, view facility. Nice. Okay, we got the proving grounds. So this is where we're going to prototype all of the stuff that we researched that we can't just build easily. Commander. It seemed like a good idea to isolate some of our more experimental concepts, especially when it comes to weapons development. Precisely. What do we have? We have the skull jack. Fourteen days. Woo! The bolt caster, the hunter's axe. The Shadow Keeper, the Frost Bomb. These are from, I believe, the Alien Hunter DLC. The Spark. What? Designed by the late Dr. Raymond Shen before the initial invasion some 20 years ago, the captured Spark robotic prototype apparently served as the progenitor for all future Advent mech designs. The Spark is a robotic combat unit serving neither defensive or high-powered combat roles. That's fun. Experimental ammo, experimental grenade, experimental heavy weapon. Those are all kind of neat. Those are all kind of neat. Um, I 
I guess we'll start with the Skulljack. That is sort of what we need to do. Yeah, let's do the Skulljack first. Immediately, Commander. I'll let you know as soon as we've made Decrease progress. Decrease Proving Ground time? No, not, not really. Not yet. Instead, what I would like to do is... Mm. No, let's go ahead. Let's do that. Let's let's shorten the time. 50%. Yeah, seven days. That That's actually significant. We'll do that. And this alien debris is going to pop here any second. Hopefully this UFO is not going to give us any problems. There we go. View room. Now I think here... Workshop... Engineers can be staffed in workshops, creating unique gremlin drones, which can be sent to staff any adjacent room or facility. Now, that being the case, ideally we would have put the gremlin drones here. We could get rid of the training center for now, actually. Hmm. That might be worth it. So what is an engineer required in here for? Nothing. So we'll be able to put an engineer in the resistance ring, in the power relay. See, I had forgotten all about the workshop. I did not lay that out properly at all. Oh, bad, bad, bad decision. Okay, here though, we're going to put the infirmary. And we're going to staff an engineer. Absolutely. Uh, the training center... Because mm. ideally, what? We're going to have the psionic lab here. The proving grounds. We'll just keep an eye out for now. I'm not sure how I want to do that yet. I did mess that up with the workshop, though. Could have got some gremlins helping us out. That's okay. It's done is done. Let's continue scanning. Let's continue building this radio relay. There were some casualties during that last oh, overt action. Commander. The tank got wounded. Our troops will all recover after some well-earned rest. Our team established contact with the Templars, and their leader claims he knows all about us. About XCOM. I'm not sure if I have any idea what he's talking about, but at least he sent one of his followers to work alongside us on the Avenger. This is where the Templar faction maintains their headquarters. I'll admit they can be a bit extreme when it comes to psionics, hmm. but so far they seem loyal to our cause. We can scan at this location to gain additional support from their people. My people understand the value of our cooperation, Commander. Nice. The elders see us as nothing more than raw materials for their design. We will take back our power and turn it against them. Nice. Oh, Commander, it's about time we spoke, don't you think? I'm Geist, leader of the Templar Order. But I'm sure you already knew that. Stories of me tend to spread far and wide. You are welcome here any time, Commander, for among all others of your kind, you alone know the true power of the Elders. You have touched their minds, you have heard their voice, and surely you know that they must fall. On behalf of all Templars, I humbly offer our services towards their demise. Together, we shall be unstoppable. All right. Well, there you have it. Uh, let's see. We got hidden reserves, tithe, hunt the chosen, hunter, part one, reduce avatar progress, gather supplies. With our success comes the opportunity for you to assign us new orders, Commander. Mm. Resource rewards on all missions increased by fifteen percent. Eh. Gain an additional plus two power on the Avenger. Neat. Lieutenant Rambunctious Ricky got a promotion. Even though he got injured. We identified additional operations to benefit the resistance. Alright, let's meet in the faction ring. So we can go into the fire. We don't have a major yet. 
we can what is this recover loot scavenge alien loot mm. sergeant plus one which will give a promotion actually let's do this let's start putting the pressure down on the hunter we might as well right soldier wounded chance low and we can negate it so let's send let's send uh heart and i lieutenant we'll get you a promotion you'll become our first captain then we'll also send kid calibre you guys are covert operators that should reduce the time it's going to take on the mission and then with you we'll send Um, let's see, the tank got wounded. We'll send Coffee Cup Dave. All right, I believe in you. Let's do it. Yep. We begin the action. Covert action immediately, Commander. Now we did get a new soldier, so let's take a look at that. We've got our Templar. Pretty exciting. What do you have? What are your What are your abilities? Psyblade, Rend, melee attack with a chance to stun or disorient the target, cannot miss, triggers momentum, and generates focus on kills. Wow, that's cool. Volt, psionic attack that deals low damage but jumps to nearby units at higher focus levels, costs one focus. Gain focus during missions, increasing stats damage and ability effectiveness focus can be spent on powerful abilities. Hmm, okay. Fire your auto pistol, does not cost an action. Amplify, causing them to take additional damage. Aftershock. Target struck by Volt will be easier to hit. After attacking with Rend, prevent all damage from the next attack instead of moving. Ooh. Ooh. I. Uh, ooh. I really. Hmm. Yeah. Yeah, let's do that. That's That sounds like a lot of fun. Okay. So we'll go back. And one of the things we will do is we will give you a name. Um. And it's Gigi. Glad you we finally joined us. Now, Gigi didn't leave a comment, but uh, Gigi watched some of my other uh, videos on my channel. But let's just say you were drafted. You were drafted. We uh, we needed some more soldiers. So now we have a Templar to take against the Hunter. That's good. Mob rage. Let's see, who is... Um, uh, you know, I guess we're going to need to change your... Your nickname to Storm Energy, and then we'll just we'll change your last name to what your call sign was, Terminator. There you go. Yeah, I want to put your name in the call sign every chance I get, uh, but you got to get the sergeant to get a call sign that can be edited. We might need more recruits before too much longer. Uh, let's give Rambunctious Ricky your promotion. Let's see what did we get? Heavy Ordnance. Grenade in your grenade only slot gains a bonus use. Yes, more grenades. I approve. That's what I want. More grenades. Wonderful. Uh, weapon upgrades. What are we talking about here? Expanded magazine. Hair trigger. Repeater. Stock. Auto loader. Critical hit chance. So the the combo that's nice, the combo that's really nice is you get the stock, which means even when you miss, you do automatic damage. Like you're guaranteed to deal damage even when you miss. And then the repeater says a 5% chance to instantly kill your target when you hit them regardless of the target's remaining HP. And with the stock, you will always hit them. So those two work really well together, but we don't have the good ones. We have the lower ones. Superior hair trigger, though. That's... That's pretty neat. I don't know if I want to do that just yet. Not just yet. We're going to hold on to those. Okay, two more days for the Psylab. Let's... This UFO is really, really close. So I think what we need to do is we need to relocate. Let's go to the Reaper the Reaper HQ intel. Or Reaper HQ and we'll get some intel. We'll get out of the way of the, the UFO over there. Commander, that <gasps> UFO contact has us locked in. We have to take evasive maneuvers. Oh no. Begin evasive maneuvers. For sector 10. 
Eastern United States. Please. Oh no. This is not going to be good at all. Figure it out. Emergency power online. Oh. Someone get me a damage report. We've got a problem. Only one? They've just dropped some sort of bike outside. It's generating the same type of pulse that knocked us out of the sky. They don't want us. They want the ship. Isn't there some way you can override it? Oh Not boy. I can't get our engines online while it's out there. Commander, we're gonna have to do this the old-fashioned way. Destroying that spike is our only chance of getting out of here. We can't let the aliens take this ship. Right. That would be bad. We're okay. Down, Commander. UFO contact has disabled our systems. Brace yourselves. The Avengers under attack must be defended at all costs. Operation Storm Dragon. We're doing this. Commander. And that is going to be where we wrap things up before we deal with the UFO event. That'll have to be next episode. So this has been XCOM 2 War, the chosen episode 13. Thank you so much for joining me. I hope you've had a good time watching. As always, I've had a good time playing. So please come back next time while we resolve the UFO combat event. But until next time, take care.